what they do is they clip little pieces and twist it into a pretzel and effectively lie. A new partnership between Oklahoma schools and conservative nonprofit PragerU sparking a fierce debate. We're breaking down all sides of the argument tonight. First, let's start with what exactly is PragerU? Yeah, Wendy, PragerU is a media group. They put out digital content described as pro-American and an alternative to, quote, dominant left-wing ideology. Now, we talk about that content, including educational videos meant for kids. And while some are welcoming this coming to Oklahoma schools, others aren't so happy. Materials from the group called PragerU, are they helpful resources or do they discriminate against certain minorities, as one advocate told us? Now, Fox 25's Tom Ferguson has been digging into all of this and has a complete breakdown for you. We want them to know about American exceptionalism, want them to know about those founding documents, want them to understand what made this country great. That was State Superintendent Ryan Walters on PragerU coming to public schools in the senior state. The group advocates for conservative principles and says it makes age-appropriate content for kids on topics ranging from history to civics to personal finance. Our goal is not to turn children into political hammers. It is the opposite of what we want to do. We want to engage families. We want to strengthen kids' education. We want kids to understand the country that they live in. According to the group's CEO, media reports have misrepresented its content on sensitive issues like slavery. We teach the horrors of slavery. We, he we teach that discrimination is a terrible thing. We teach that America has really grown and evolved. We want kids to grow up understanding both the good and the bad. She says the resources are free to use if wanted and encourages parents and teachers to browse their website to see the materials for themselves. But one advocate for Muslims in Oklahoma says their content is biased against members of his faith community and others. As Prager U is definitely skewed towards a certain political and Christian nationalistic white savior message that is not beneficial for minorities of any background here in Oklahoma. As a as a Muslim and as a father here in Oklahoma, I would want Ryan Walters to know that he is really playing with the lives and the emotions of people in our state. Adam Sultani also faulted the video's ability to even give a good picture on complex issues, citing one in particular that describes persecution against Egypt's minority Coptic Christian community. They're five or six minute videos, and you cannot tell the story of a complex and complicated relationship between two of the major world religions in a country like Egypt or any other country in the Middle East or the world in a five minute snippet. Now PragerU is responding to Sultani's comments. The CEO said in part, quote, CARE is an organization that stands against American values. It's no surprise they're trying to take prayer you down. She then went on to say in part, quote, unlike CARE, we do not attack people based on their religion, country of origin, race, or gender. We're going to have their full response to CARE's claims on OKCFox.com. We'll also have links to their content posted so you can view it for yourself and make up your own mind. The Oklahoma Education Association released a statement. It says in part, OEA continues to believe that curriculum offered in Oklahoma classrooms should meet the high standards set by our local education professionals. PragerU is not a legitimate accredited education organization. It is a media organization whose creator has admitted PragerU material indoctrinates kids. You can find OEA's full statement on OKCFox.com.